Hi, welcome to Own Your Worth. I'm Dana. Perfectionist tendencies, perfectionism, being perfect. So on the surface, we all know there's no such thing as perfect, right? You can say it, you can spout it. Yep, I know that. You know, I'm trying not to be perfect. I understand that having expectations of perfectionism are unrealistic and unhealthy. You know, there's a lot of buzz around it. But what I'd like to talk today about is doing some soul searching in your quiet time about the areas in your life where you are allowing the idea of being perfect to infiltrate and infect. And I don't use those words lightly. I believe perfectionists and perfectionism and the concept of being perfect is truly something no different than a virus that we have to really work to eradicate and heal. When we get sick with a cold, we take care of ourselves. Some people take cold medicine, others try natural remedies, and you heal. Okay? So thinking that you need to be perfect in any way is no different than introducing a virus to your body. Okay? Why do I say this? Because there are no positive qualities to thinking or expecting perfection. It's unachievable. So you've already in your own mind failed. And I will link the episode I just finished on the fact that there is no failure. <laughs> so there's that. But when we strive for perfection, we are lying to ourselves pretty significantly. And that is about the most unhealthy um, practice that we can self have. Okay, that's self harm at its best when we are lying to ourselves, judging, berating, shaming, and living with guilt, because the idea is that you have to be perfect. There are, I'm just going to list a few um, of the areas where I really would like you to maybe think, okay, is this an area where I'm holding myself to a, an expectation of perfectionism, right? Um, our physical body and the beauty of our physical body. Taking care of elderly parents or grandparents or siblings. Being a caregiver for somebody who is sick or dying. Our job, if you're in college or high school, your classes, um, you, you, the way you're living your life in terms of like your financial budget, um, the cleanliness of your home, the way that you interact with people. Are you afraid that people might know who you really are and therefore won't love you, like you, accept you? Nothing to worry about. Just work on the perfectionist expectation. And that should start to dissipate. Because it's all a big lie. It's all a big, very toxic lie. There is no such thing as perfect. The idea of perfectionists and perfectionism is toxic. And it is a virus that needs to be eradicated from here and here. If this speaks to you, please add comments. If you're new to the channel, welcome. It's a big heavy one, but I'm glad you stopped by. Um, I hope that you consider subscribing. And to my subscribers, thank you, thank you for being with me all the way. I appreciate every single one of you. Until next time, namaste.